for the talk, the game in which some of the area's brightest students have an opportunity to demonstrate their knowledge. My name is Isaac Rennert, and I have my illustrious scorekeeper here, uh, Aaron Dos Remedios, uh, and welcome to the game. Uh, on Team A, we have Glebe, which has Micah Coleman, Caleb Ott, Liz Van Urschat, and their captain, uh, Gabe uh, McMurrin. And for Team B, I have uh, Dawson College from uh, Montreal, Quebec going up against uh, Ottawa's Glebe, of course, with Imaj Baharun uh, as their captain, then Jared Lackman minkoff uh, Jesse Sunderland, Sutherland, and Anthony Gagliano. With that all being said and done, let's begin the game. We will begin with a 40-point snap start to begin round one. Along with Sir Johnny McDonald, what Bleu leader and father... That's Micah. Georges-Étienne Cartier. That's correct. Um, uh, yep. It, 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 are we going to keep on with this? Nope, nope, nope. We will... I've set it to no cue. All right. What is the least common multiple of 8 and 12? That's Caleb. 24. That's correct. Uh, Hardly Working and Jake and Amir are web shows hosted on what pedagogically named comedy website? That's uh, Yamaj. Uh, humor. That's correct. Uh, and finally, Teriyaki Boys provided the theme song to which Fast and Furious film? That's Anthony. Okay, Shift. That's correct. We're going to move into a 30-point open question on the Holy Roman Empire. The Holy Roman Empire was ruled for the longest period of time by which dynasty? That is also a... That's Micah. Habsburg. That's correct. Uh, the Holy, Ro Holy Roman electors of Mainz, Trier, and Cologne all held what religious title? That's Micah. Bishop. Nope. I'll move to the other side uh, for Dawson. That's Imaj. Archbishop. That's correct. And what leader dissolved the Holy Roman Empire? That's Micah. Francis II. Nope. Uh, replacing it with the Confederation of the Rhine. I'll go to Dawson. That's Imaj. Napoleon. That's correct. Sorry. Uh, for Dawson. We're going to move into a 40-point team question. Scramble for 10 points. What subfield of biology concerns itself with the naming and classification? That's Gabe. Taxonomy. The remaining questions go to Glebe Collegiate Institute and deal with taxonomy. I will require a buzz for each answer. Which taxonomic rank, such as Lepidoptera and primates, is one level broader than a family? Micah. That's it, Gabe. Order. That's correct. Uh, what formalizer of binomial nomenclature is considered the father of modern taxonomy? Linnaeus. Go for it. Okay. Oh. Linnaeus. That's correct. And what five-letter term refers to a single complete branch on the tree of life, also called a monophyletic group? Clade. Clade. Yes. That's Gabe? Clade. Uh, that's correct. We're going to move into a 20-point special. Dawson College, you're back in. Name all four of the principal colors in the CMYK color model. That's Gabe. Cyan, magenta, black and yellow yes that's correct for 20 nice. nice nice we're going to move into a 40 point open question on spelling okay Gabe, it is have a, fun it is a large ungulate with several subspecies including white black and sumatran spell rhinoceros that's image r h i n o c e r o s that's correct uh for dawson uh it means the act of sailing around the world spell sir, that's gabe S uh, C I R no, C U M N A V I G A T I O N. I cannot take that. I'm sorry. Spell circumnavigation. That's an image. C I R C U M N A V I G A T I O N. 
That's correct for Dawson. Uh, it is an instrument that uses colored glass to create symmetrical pictures. That's Caleb. K-A-L-E-I-D-O-S-C-O-P-E. That's correct for Glebe. And finally, it is a chemical compound produced by tea and coffee plants. Spell caffeine. That's Yimaj. E-A-F-F-E-I-N-E. That's correct. We'll move now into an assigned question on American authors. I'm going to start with Glebe Collegiate Institute, where Micah will be across from Yimaj, uh, Caleb across from Jared, Liz across from Jesse, and Gabe across from Anthony. Let's begin. I will require a buzz for each answer. Who chronicled the lives of the four March sisters in her novel, Little Women? Uh, that's Micah. Alcott. That's correct. Uh, for Caleb, who wrote the true crime novel in Cold Blood, as well as the novella Breakfast at Tiffany's? That's Caleb. Capote. That's correct. I'll go to Liz. Who wrote The Age of Innocence and Ethan Frome? Uh, Liz? A Smith. No, I will now go to Jesse. Uh, Jesse? John. No, this is Edith Wharton. And I'll go to Gabe now. What science fiction author wrote Do Androids Dream of Electric Sheep and The Man in the High Castle? That's Gabe. Philip K. Dick. That's correct for Glebe. We're going to move now to Dawson College. What Russian-born American author wrote Pale Fire but is perhaps best known for Lolita? It's Yimaj. Nabokov. That's correct. Uh, for Jared, uh, who wrote the classic novel Fahrenheit 451? Oh, uh, answer, I'll call time. I'll move to Caleb. That's Caleb. Bradbury. Uh, that's correct for Glebe. Uh, for Jesse, who wrote the epistolary novel The Color Purple? No. I'll call time. I'll go to Liz. That's Liz. Smith. This is Alice Walker. And finally for Anthony, who wrote Uncle Tom's, Tom's Cabin? I'll call time for Gabe. That's Gabe. Harriet Beecher Stowe. That's correct for Glebe. We'll move into a snap out that, to end the round. What children's TV show used Won't You Be My Neighbor as it's, that's Gabe. Mr. Rogers. Nope. Uh, as its themes, that's uh, Yimaj. Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. That's correct. Uh, for Challenge. Dawson. Uh, noted. Noted. Uh, Amour, The Square, and Parasite are all recent winners of which highest award? That's Gabe. Best International Film. Nope. Academy at Award. The Con F that's uh, Jesse. Oscar. No, at the Cannes Film Festival. It was the Palme d'Or. Uh, in what U.S. city would I find Hartsfield-Jackson Airport? That's Yimaj. Jackson, Mississippi. Uh, no, I'll go to the other. That's Gabe. Atlanta. That's correct for Glebe. And finally, what Czech playwright coined the term? Wrote, that's uh, Caleb. Capac. That's correct for Glebe. Uh, that's the end of the round. Are there any further challenges apart from Miss Rogers? Uh, sorry, I was doing a lot of pre-buzzing. I'll try not to do okay. that. Uh, with that, mm -hmm. I'll check a score with Aaron. Uh, yes, the score after round one is 170 for Glebe, 90 for Dawson College. All right, still anybody's game. Let's move into round two. What letter is the Roman numeral for 500? That's Caleb. D. Uh, that's correct for Glebe. Name either of the two cities that contain a mile zero marker for the Trans-Canada Highway. That's Micah. St. John's. That's correct. Uh, for Glebe, what is the medical term for a lack of voluntary motor muscle? That's Yamash. Muscular dystrophy. Nope. Uh, voluntary mus motor muscle coordination. That's a Caleb. Uh, paralysis. Uh, this is ataxia. Uh, Paris's Musée d'Orsay is located in what specific kind of structure? That's Caleb. A key. Nope. I'll go to the other side. That's Yamash. Hear me. Pardon? No, nope. uh, a train station. 40 point open question on little rappers. Which rapper had initial popularity with a Nicki Minaj stan Twitter account before releasing the set? That's it, Liz. Little Nas X. That's correct for Glebe. Uh, which emo rapper? That's it, Liz. Little Peep. That's correct for Glebe. Uh, Real G's move in silence like lasagna is a line that's Imash. Lil Wayne. That's correct for Dawson. And incorporating pop culture references in his music, including a Scott Pilgrim-inspired album cover, which rapper is responsible for tracks like Futsal Shuffle 2020 and Exo Tour Life? 
That's Yamash. Lizzie V. That's correct for Dawson. Who am I? Clue A. My thoughts and my provincial letters were influential Christian writings of my time. Who am I for 40 points? That's Yamash. Ralute. Nope, I'll go to the other side. Gabe? Minus. Nope, I'll go to clue B. At the age of 19, I began work on what would become the first successful mechanical calculator. Who am I for? That's Caleb. Blaise Pascal. That's correct for 30 points nice. for Glee. Nice. Mm -hmm. We're going to move to a 40-point open question on music, classical music and film. Has, his, has Caleb's been recorded? Pardon? Has Caleb's buzz been recorded? I'm not seeing it uh, on yeah. the... Uh, yep, yep, it was. Um, which Russian composer included the Battle of the Ice in his score for Alexander Nevsky and a famous troika in his score? That's Micah. Tchaikovsky. No, uh, in his score for Lieutenant Kije. Other side for Dawson. Sorry again. I'll call time. Call this is Sergei Prokofiev. Uh, which composer of a noted film score for the experimental film Koyanis Katsi is better known for his minimalist opera Einstein? Uh, that's Caleb. Glass. That's correct for Glebe. Uh, Johann Strauss is on the beautiful blue Danube. Uh, that's Caleb. What? Nope. Uh, Georgi Ligeti's Lux Eterna and Richard Strauss's also spoke Zarathustra, all famously featured in which Stanley Kubrick film? That's Yimaj. Right. Could that be Space Odyssey? Pardon? A Space Odyssey. Could that be Space Odyssey? No. I will not take that. This is 2001 A Space Odyssey. Uh, that's okay. what he said, he said first. the first time. That's, that's, that's what, what he said, said first. first. Okay, okay. Uh, if that's what teams agree on, I'll give the point. Uh, in the original Die Hard movie, uh, what triumphant section from a larger work plays when the terrorists open the vaults containing the bonds they want to... That's Caleb. Flight of the Valkyries. Nope. Uh, containing the bonds they want to steal. I'll call time for uh, Dawson. This is Ode to Joy. 40-point open question on the color yellow. Which metallic element can come in a powdered... That's Jesse. Gold. Uh, no. Can come in a powdered ore called yellow cake. That's it, Caleb. Uranium. That's correct for a bleed. In which country did the yellow vest movement begin? That's Micah. France. That's correct for Glebe. Uh, what is the largest city on Great Slave Lake? That's Micah. Yellowknife. That's correct for Glebe. And the Fraunhofer D2 absorption line is caused by which element that glows an intense yellow in the flame? Uh, that's Jared. Ulfur? Nope. Uh, flame test. That's Caleb. Cobalt. This is sodium. We're going to move to a 40-point open question on the odd one out. Given a category and a list of four items, name the item that does not belong to the category. SI-derived unit. Radian, Candela, Ohm, uh, Jared. Uh, Candela. That's correct for Dawson. Clouds, Serratus, Cirrus. That's Micah. Serratus. That's correct for Glebe. Official languages of South American countries. French, English, Por that's Micah. French. Uh, no. Uh, Portuguese and German. This is, uh, that's Yimaj. German. That's correct for Dawson. And Challenge. Okay. French Canada. Yeah. yeah. French nope. Guiana is not a country. Uh, first, first names of U.S. presidents: Martin, Walter, Calvin. Eh, that's Gabe. Walter. That's correct uh, for Glebe. We're going to move to a forty-point team question. Scramble for ten points. What war featured the first use of jet fighters in aerial? That's Gabe. World War One. Nope. Uh, in aerial combat and lasted from 1950 to 1953. On its namesake, that's Ibaj. Korean War. That's correct. The remaining questions deal with the Korean War and go to Dawson College. I will require a buzz for each answer. Before the war, what line of latitude divided North Korea from South Korea? Ooh, you guys remember this? I forget. That's Jared? 73rd parallel? This is the 38th parallel. Oh. What legendary American general was relieved? That's Imaj. Douglas McCarthy. That's correct. And what first president of South Korea led his country through the Korean War? That's Yamaj. That's correct. 60 point chain snappers to end the round. Uh, Glebe, you're back in. What singer released a 1973 album called Goodbye Yellow Brick Road? That's it, Liz. Elton John. That's correct. In what small meadow was the Magna Carta signed by King John? That's Yamaj. No, uh, that's Caleb. Runnymede. 
that's correct for Glebe. Which river flows through the towns of Reading, Oxford, Runnymede? That's Micah. Uh, the Thames. That's correct for Glebe. Which German-born composer wrote water music? That's Micah. Handel. Uh, that's correct for Glebe. The first English king of which name brought Handel to? Uh, that's Micah. George. That's correct for Glebe. And finally, which colorful piece of headgear is associated with the best friend of the? That's Caleb. Yellow hat. That's correct for Glebe. That's the end of the round. Are there any further challenges moving forward? Uh, with that, I guess uh, we'll take a score check. So we just have the one challenge this round, yes? Yes, yes, yeah. for French. Okay. Uh, and I just, want, I just want to verify that uh, that Glebe swept all six chain snappers, correct? Uh, I Elton think so. Jones, yes. Run immediate attempts. Yes. Okay. Yes. And the score I have after round two is 360 for Glebe, 170 for Dawson College. All right. Uh, with that all said and done, let's get moving into round three. 40-point snaps start to begin round three. What mountain that shares its name with a country is the world's tallest with that? That's Micah. Uh, Mount Kenya. That's correct. Uh, for Glebe. Which king of Mycenae was murdered by his wife, Clim... Uh, that's... Sorry. Micah? Uh, Agamemnon. That's correct. Uh, in autopsies, a fracture of what floating bone often indicates the victim was strangled? That's Gabe. Ioid. That's correct. And uh, the largest lake entirely on what continent is Lake Ladoga? That's Micah. Europe. Uh, that's correct for Glebe. We're going to move to a 30-point open on ballet terms. What three-word French term refers to a dance duet in which two dancers perform this? That's Caleb. How to do it. That's correct for Glebe. Uh, the, from the French for bent, what word refers to that's Caleb? Clear. That's correct for Caleb. And the heels are together with toes pointing outward in which ordinal ballet position? That's Micah. Uh, north position. Nope. Other side for Dawson. That's Imaj. Can, can. Uh, no, this is first position, or position one. Oh, sorry. Well, we're moving yeah. to a 40-point team question. Scramble for 10 points. I had the feeling that I belonged. I had the feeling I could be someone. Our lines from the course of which 19... That's Jared. On the waterfront? No. Of which 1988 folk pop hit by Chase, Tracy Chapman. That's Liz. Um, Fast Car. That's correct. The remaining question is nice. auto, nice. race, auto racing and go to... Such clean. a good song. <laughs> Baku City, Suzuka, and DeMonaco are closed circuits for which World Championship Racing Series? Isn't it NASCAR? No. And that's Gabe? NASCAR. This is Formula One. What last name is shared by father and son Canadian Formula One racers? Gilles and... Yeah. Gilles. 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 That's uh, Gabe. That's correct. Gilles. And uh, which seven-time NASCAR Winston Cup winner died due to injuries sustained during the final lap of the 2001 Daytona 500? Uh, or Earnhardt. It's Earnhardt. No. That's Gabe? Earnhardt. Uh, prompt. Dale Earnhardt Sr. That's correct. Nice. All right. 30-point uh, open question on company etymologies. A term from the board game Go inspired the name of what early video game company? That's it, Micah. Nintendo. Uh, no. I'll go to the other side. Dawson. That's Imaj. Atari. Uh, Pern. Atari. That's correct. Uh, in 1971, the National Biscuit Company shortened its name to what? That's Gabe. Nabisco. That's correct. And a Latin word meaning I roll provided the name for what? That's Caleb. Volvo. That's correct for Glebe. What city am I? Clue A. Alexander von Humboldt gave me the nickname the city of palaces because many noble residents of me. That's Imaj. Vienna. Uh, no, built, ex that's G Gabe. Lima? No, uh, extravagant palatial homes, especially in the 17th and 18th centuries. Uh, what city am I? Clue B. My central square is officially called Constitution Square, but is commonly known as the Zocalo. I am, that's Micah. Buenos Aires? No, uh, I am divided into 16 alcaldias. Uh, what city am I for 30? That's Jesse. Hanover? No. Clue C. For centuries, I suffered from periodic floods from the former Lake Texcoco, which is now... That's Yamaj. Uh, Rio. No. Uh, that's Micah. Mexico City. For 20 points. Nice. Mm. Uh, 120 points snap out to end the game. What compound term refers to the combined total of water loss due to vaporization from the ground and release from plant stomata? Uh, that's Yamaj. Respiration. 
Nope. I'll go to the other side. That's Gabe. Transpiration. Uh, this is evapotranspiration. Uh, what is the minimum age requirement to become an MP in Canada? That's uh, Gabe. 18. Uh, that is correct uh, for Glebe. What 1998 film starring Drew Barrymore is subtitled A Cinderella Story? That's uh, Liz. Um, Ever After. That's correct. And which MP from Nipissing to Miskaming is the, that's Micah? Anthony Rhoda. That's correct for Glebe. What is a dried plum called? That's a uh, Gabe. Burn. Uh, yes. Name one of the two non-country teams that played in the 2016 World Cup of Hockey. That's Micah. Uh, Scotland. No, uh, that played in the, tw that's Jared. Team Europe. That's correct, or Team North America. On what island was Nelson Mandela imprisoned for? That's Gabe. Robben Island. That's correct. What is the name of the first level in most Sonic the Hedgehog games? That's Micah. Green Hill Zone. That's correct. Uh, what city is the setting of the TV show, The Wire? That's Micah. Baltimore. That's correct. Uh, what is the term for the distinctive fabric pattern used on plaid kilts? That's Liz. Um... No, I'll go to the other side. That's Imaj. Yes. Uh, who tutored Alexander the Great? And also, that's Micah. Aristotle. That's correct. And what is the only known work by Michelangelo that is signed by the artist? That is Gabe. Yeta. Yeah, uh, that's correct. I'll move into tiebreakers as they are always necessary. Fort Smith in Sebastian County is the second largest. That's Gabe. Arkansas. That's correct. Uh, what adjective describes water that is saltier than fresh water, but not that's Gabe? Brackish. That's correct. Uh, what country borders both Panama and Brazil? That's Micah? Colombia. That's correct. And finally, what is the five letter word for a courtroom judge's small mallet? Uh, Micah? Gavel. That's correct. That's the end of the game. Uh, nice. Good job to both teams. Are there any further challenges? Sorry, I did a lot of pre buzzing in that one. That's okay. Okay. You All right. There was a lot of That's... good buzzing as your score shows. You stay aggressive, Micah. All right. All right. Uh, so with that, uh, the final score that I have is 580 for Glebe, 200 for Dawson College. Good job. Good, 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 good game. All right. And the challenges uh, shall move forward. Oh. We have two challenges. Uh, I will just verify with you what questions they are on. Can you tell me the question number as well, oh, just so I can uh, yeah. present uh, this So, the first challenge was on which which answer? One. Wasn't mm -hmm. it on the French one? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. So the French was second. Oh, okay. Do you second? remember what the yeah, first challenge was the first then? One is. Uh, let's go through this again. Let me see if I can find it. Uh, I don't <laughs> see it. Do you remember... Uh, Isaac, do you remember which what the first challenge was on? The first challenge was on. I'm going to take a look here. here. Uh, let's let's just go through that. All the answers. And you tell me if you remember. Okay, the answer is where. Uh, oh, Mr. Rogers. It was Mr. Oh, Rogers' yeah. neighborhood. Uh, okay. The uh, given is... answer was Mr. Rogers. Okay, that yeah. was question twenty-five. Twenty-five. Yep. Yeah. And I think the I second been prompted on that one. And the second challenge was the. Uh, official languages of South African countries, uh, South American countries. Uh, that is question number 48. Uh, those are the only two challenges. Okay, so uh, with that, that is it. All right, thank you very much for coming. Uh, excellent job from both teams. Uh, good luck with the rest of your games today. Thank you for coming.